Hello and welcome to Lynn TV, your local internet news station from Paphos. I'm Lucy Robson with the main stories today. Tourist officials have held an emergency meeting following news that 2,009 bookings to the island have dropped considerably. Proposed measures include reducing VAT on tourism services from 8 to 5 percent and the abolition of night tax on hotels during the winter season, plus a reduction during the summer. The Paphos Green Party have asked the government to take action against illegal quarrying in the Vuni area. For more than one year, pillagers have been helping themselves to stone, which is sold all over Cyprus to decorate villas. The party says that fines for illegal quarrying are nominal and have not had any deterring impact. Hermes Airport say they have hit a new record for passenger traffic at both local airports. Last year, more than 7 million passengers passed through Larnaca and Paphos, an increase of 3.26%. Paphos Municipality says that it will continue to fight for a university campus. It believes that a campus will inject new life and money into the town, but the Education Ministry says there is no chance of a site being located locally. Finally, the post office in central Paphos is opening its doors in a new location tomorrow. The office is now located in the Anavagos area and will have 700 new PO boxes available for rent. We'll be back tomorrow. Thanks for watching.